Happy Independence Day. I've got something here I'm doing a little experiment out in my garden. We had extra sweet potato slips after filling our grow box out in our soil garden and didn't know what to do with them. Didn't want to just throw them away. Couldn't give them away. So I decided to put them here in the greenhouse under our structure where we grow vertically. I'm training these guys to grow vertically and see how they do. Now the reason I do this is a sweet potato when it vines out it takes over the garden not necessarily a problem but it becomes difficult to apply a weekly feed and it becomes difficult to weed because they're growing out over our soil this is not a mitt lighter method thing this is me experimenting and goofing with it i don't know what the results are going to be so far i have determined the sweet potato does not train up the twine on its own. We have to do it ourselves. You know, it would probably help if you could see what I'm talking about. So every couple of days I have to wrap the sweet potato vine around the twine. Not a big problem. I've got four of them started here up the twine already and I think I have three more that are to the size that they need to go up. Again, it would help if you could see what I'm talking about. I will start those up the twine here soon and see how they do. I don't know if this is going to work out. I don't know if it's going to be a pain. Don't have a clue. But if you're interested in seeing how this progresses towards the end of the year, please leave a comment and let me know. If there's not much interest in it, this will be the last video on it. It should work. It will keep all of that vining material off of the ground so it's easier to maintain, so it's easier to control weeds. I don't know if it'll be worth the time and effort. Anyway, quick video for the day. If you're still here, I'd appreciate it if you take the time to rate the video. Thank you for watching. Happy gardening.